Hey everybody, how y'all doing? Uh, so we're going to... Compare, as I said I would, we're going to compare all the, uh, the Vibe, what is it called? Vibe Sound speaker systems uh, that DG has to offer. Uh, I guess we'll start with the oldest one. I bought this one about a year ago. It's called uh, the Vibe Sound Portable Stereo Speaker. I was disappointed at the get-go with it. These are all Bluetooth speakers, but we're going to use the uh, we're going to use the, the plug-in uh, because uh, that'll be faster, and we can switch between them. You can kind of hear the difference of the sound. Uh, so this is the by the way, this is the way the, the phone itself sounds. That's the phone. Just a, it's just a cheap LG phone. And we'll plug it into the Vibe Portable Stereo Speaker to get started with. Let's, let's hear what it sounds like. It's actually quieter. It sounds better, but quieter. Like a full blast. I'll give it credit. It's better. It's a better quieter. sound, but yeah, you you're not gonna have a party with that. You know. Okay, and then the next one is the most recent one I purchased, uh, which we just did a video on very short, very short time ago. Uh, we'll click it on, and here's what it sounds like. That's full black. I don't like it. You like it? The problem with this one, the big problem with this one is it's louder, but it doesn't sound as good. The sound quality sounds is awful. Horrible. It sounds horrible. It's uh. And you might not be able to tell because it's on camera. But that's horrible in life. Yeah, that that's ho I don't know how it sounds in one camera, but yeah, in real life that's horrible. The next one I bought, or the, the second to the last one I bought was this. It's uh, I don't know, it's another vibe, vibe sound. Uh, this one's called the Boom Wireless Speaker. Boom Wireless Speaker. And uh, all of these have an auxiliary on them. I can at least say that for them. Okay, that one's on. I'm gonna say I think maybe this is the better sound. This one has your treble coming out this end. Your bass comes out this end. Oh, what I do? I did something. It, uh, But I don't know if you can tell because the bass, although the bass is coming out the back, it's very quiet. And it gets way overpowered by the treble. But this does sound better than this. However, it seems to be, you know, I think the battery is probably too low on it. Okay, so then you have that now. Just for shits and grins, uh, Keaton also bought one of the, these same things. And I just thought, hey, let's, since we're comparing, let's see what his sound is like. I don't know, why not? Exactly the same. Yeah. At least they're consistent. There's your bass in. Very weak, very weak in the base. But uh, there you have it. So that's that's your. Wait, I didn't play this in full blast. So do that. It doesn't sound good when it's when it's way up. But this is the loudest one of the three, I think. The three different kinds. I well, believe. you didn't full blast the other one either, though. Yeah, I did. Oh, you did? Yeah. 
Huh. Yeah, I played them all full blast. So, uh, definitely, definitely, this, this is the louder one, but it sounds like, pretty much like shit, too. But, again, if you look in there, you can see the speaker, and it's just a tiny little, maybe a dime size speaker, or a, a quarter size speaker, you know. Yeah. Oh, Keaton, you want to talk through your... You want to see what it sounds like whenever... So this is a high-priced microphone we got. Yeah. Really high-priced. How about $50? Uh, no. Nah, it was only 15 20 bucks. So it's not that high-priced, but... But the problem with this is you can't... It's just a microphone, so I can't say stuff, and you won't be able to hear it until I put my hand in this and talk it's into not, it. It's not power. But, so... This is what it sounds like whenever I'm on. <laughs> so it's like on my mobile dogs or my dirt bike, but the problem is it doesn't work in my camera for some reason. And if you want to test it too. Of course, you can do that with all of these. Plug a mic in the back of them. Yeah, but this is just for, you know. But the biggest difference is that you can hear this one. And these ones with a mic, you probably, if you could hear anything, you'd, you'd hear very little. Because this does have the better amplifier by far. As, or the louder one. The only thing is, when you turn it that loud, it sounds like crap. So, still, my advice is that if you want a good Bluetooth speaker that has good bass, and you want, uh, especially if you want some wattage, you want some power, <laughs> your best bet is to not go to Dollar General to buy it. Go you know any almost anywhere else probably to to buy one and you're gonna have to spend a little bit more than you know ten or twenty dollars for it you're probably gonna spend at least forty fifty dollars i'd say thirty at least thirty bucks the one we bought was sixty dollars to, to, to be a really good one but yeah anyway and here's the box for this one if you want to buy this one at your local dar general yeah that's the box for it I forget who's got the red one. I got the red one. No, you got the red one. Yeah. I got the black one. Yeah. I don't remember. Colors don't mean much to me. But anyways, uh, well, that's that's what we've got. Uh, thanks for watching. And uh, I hope I can bring you uh, some real good uh, Bluetooth uh, speaker videos soon. Because I, I'm really disappointed in all, all three of these. So anyways, uh, there you go. Actually, what I'm doing is looking for one to go on my boat. And we want some good, uh, you know, real good. It doesn't have to be super loud, but I want some real good bass. And, uh, yeah. yeah. Okay, so thanks for watching. We'll see you next Tuesday.